All right, here's a really quick demo of uh, something I just started playing with. Uh, trying to get some multi-touch working here, so I built my own little uh, box. You can't really see it that well, but I'm not going to switch the light around because it's calibrated right now. Uh, but it's a picture frame and uh, a wooden box that I made. Got a light right above. This is the best way to get it to work. And here's the multi-touch. Um, so I'm going to rest this. Well, we'll see what happens. So I'm uh, touching the screen here and you can see that I'm getting some sort of a reaction. So as I pinch, it zooms out. Uh, let's see if we can get both in one shot. Spread it out. Um, calibration's not that great right now. Um, I'm going to need to probably change this to some sort of a different type of paper. Um, but the point is that it sort of works. Um, it's picking up quite a few positions on my fingers. The shadows are proving to be a little bit of a problem right now. But you can see there, there is some sort of an interaction. Um, let's see if I can get this video to play. Well, you get the idea. And uh, here's the way the calibration's working. If I can get my shadow out of the way there. Um, it's pretty cool. Uh, picking up the points. So anyway, this is, uh, this is my first try. Um, I probably spent about $15 total on gr getting this set up. Um, and I have to say the most difficult part of the entire process was finding uh, Vista drivers for my Logitech webcam. But everything else has been a lot of fun and I will keep adding to anything else that I find with this.